is John Morris. I'm the Secretary and Chief Operating Officer of the American Thyroid Association. And I'm here today to speak with you about the Ridgeway Legacy Fund of the ATA. Uh, in honor of Professor Chip Ridgeway's contributions to the development of young thyroidologists uh, over almost two decades within our organization, we established this fund to honor his memory uh, and his tremendous contributions to education of young persons in our group. After Professor Ridgeway's uh, unfortunate passing uh, a bit more than a year ago, we established the Ridgeway Legacy Fund to support the travel, uh, education, housing, uh, and contributions of young thyroidologists uh, to the ATA. Thus, it is extremely important that we are successful in continuing the training of these young people, and that is the purpose of the Ridgeway Legacy Fund. Chip Ridgeway was a good friend and colleague of mine um, who came from uh, Cody, Wyoming, and uh, actually uh, grew up with his father being a very revered country doctor, and he really had amazing uh, training uh, at uh, the University of Colorado for medical school and then went out uh, to Massachusetts General to do his endocrine training and came back to Colorado which was very fortunate for us to head the division of endocrinology uh, where I met him and he became my mentor and Chip is the reason why I am in uh, the thyroid field now. Uh, I remember him telling me that he, I should come work in his laboratory to learn thyroid and I said to him isn't everything already known about the thyroid? And that was probably about 25, 26 years ago, and I realize now how uh, forward-thinking he was to tell me that uh, there's a lot more to learn. I think I know less about the thyroid now than I did 26 years ago, and really it's because of Chip's mentorship and guidance. Um, he also was a wonderful uh, cyclist and we rode bike together a lot and he uh, was a great athlete uh, in playing basketball and football and he really brought a lot of that into his uh, ability to uh, talk with patients and to um, really mentor everyone from faculty to students. Everyone loved to work with him because he was such a great clinician and a fantastic teacher. I'm Brian Haugen. Thank you so much for your support of the Ridgeway uh, program here at the American Thyroid Association. This not only teaches uh, many different trainees, but inspires them to consider the field of thyroidology and to help the many patients uh, with thyroid disorders. It's a real wonderful tribute to his legacy uh, and an inspiration to so many people. You can uh, donate at the American Thyroid Association website, and again, we thank you so much for your support. I'm Stephanie Fish. I'm the co-director of the Chip Ridgeway Fellowship Training Program with Andrew Giannakakis. Um, the Fellowship Training Program, we bring over 50 fellows to the ATA meeting. We have time where we get foundation in thyroidology. They have lectures and learn about the thyroid, and then opportunities for the fellows to present interesting cases to experts in the field, as well as programs to help um, with career development and their plans for the future. I have one of the fellows with us today. This is Raquel Cano, and she's from Venezuela, and she's joining us for the conference this year. Raquel, can you tell us a little bit about what it means for you to come to the Chip Ridgeway conference this year? Well, this is the first time I come to the ATA meeting, and it's gonna be a great experience. I come all the way from Venezuela. It wouldn't have been possible to be here. It wouldn't have been for the fund. I hopefully, I want to share my research and meet experts like Stephanie. I can get some feedback and take this back to Venezuela to my research center and help other fellows as well. On behalf of the ATA and the Chip Ridgeway Fellowship Training Program, we want to thank you for considering to support our program, which is so important to Raquel and to all of the fellows who participate. On behalf of the American Thyroid Association, I thank you for your interest thyroid training and research and for your contributions to the Ridgeway Legacy Fund.